Hello everyone, I'm Rita Garcia with Asian Connection. Every year thousands of refugees are resettled here in Houston by the U.S. State Department, but they can face a number of barriers making a new life in a new country. But there is a local micro enterprise program that helps to empower refugee women. It's called the Community Cloth and here with more details, please welcome the founder of Our Global Village, Roxanne Paiva. Good morning to you, Roxanne. Good morning. So for folks who are not familiar with the program, tell us what it's all about. The Community Cloth is a micro-enterprise to empower refugee women right here in Houston. The women are they're weavers, they're jewelry makers, they're knitters, they are incredibly talented. The co-founder, Quinn Ann, and I, we were volunteers in the refugee community, and we found that they had so many talents and strengths. Uh, and what we did is we saw a problem, and we came up with, with a solution alongside the women. The goals of the program are to gain financial income for the artisans, to gain entrepreneurial skills mm -hmm. through knowledge and training, as well as to gain emotional support through the other participants of the program. When you say emotional support, a lot of these women are, are they fleeing? Are they, they're coming from Asia, is that correct? Yeah, we have about 30 active artisans, about half of them are Bhutanese. We also have women from Iraq, Sudan, the Congo, and Burma. These women have endured uh, war, political per persecution, ethnic persecution, and upwards of living in refugee camps uh, upwards of 18 years before resettling here in Houston. Wow, and so they definitely have a different lifestyle here in Houston, mm -hmm. and uh, with the program, we have some stuff right here on the set. What is this? This is obviously talent. Yeah, we have products uh, from the knitters creating hats, scarves, shawls, shrugs. We have the weavers who knit or who weave scarves and bags we the jewelry makers we mm -hmm. have all kinds of product and what's so wonderful is a hundred percent of the proceeds go back to the artisans what do you think the program means to these participants it's an emotional topic because it means so much to the women it's been so neat we started this in 2009 and to see their their confidence right. their skills their talents we know that this that this is going to make an impact on future generations of these families. It sure will. And Roxanne, if anyone at home wants to get involved, wants to become a volunteer, how can they get information or, or do you all even need volunteers? Oh, we absolutely need volunteers. I think this is a great time mm -hmm. to challenge all the viewers here mm -hmm. to get involved, to get involved today. You can support the program financially, you can volunteer your time, and what the best part is, is you can get your friends together and host an in-home community cloth party. That's our bread and butter. That Absolutely. is where we sell a lot of product and you're, you and your friends can support the cause. And they are just beautiful. Thank you so much, Roxanne, for coming in and sharing all that wonderful information. We really appreciate it. Thank you. All right, and be sure to join us again next time for more Asian Connection.